Oh my God, look at that dress right there. I don't know. Cardinal, can you please not be mean to me? Whatever. We have those fabulous twins who are back. We're back. Oh, look at this one. Well, I'm not gonna let you outdo me, that's for sure. <laughs> I, I will outdo you, honey. <laughs> we came here a couple of years ago to help Margo find a dress. All right. I love it. I think it's pretty. Drag! <laughs> can I just remind you the last time we were here? Are you serious? Margo, I'm telling you, the feathers. She looks like she should be on top of a cake. Her behind she is said, as wide as the New Jersey Turnpike. Hey, but I saved you from yourself. Margo, I'm not going to let you leave in here a hot mess, I promise you. As long as you're just not extra and mean to me, we'll be fine. the competition starting all over again? No competition. She's in competition. She's in competition. Marlo, are you kidding me? I can't even believe it. Oh, my God, I was so happy to see Lisa. She's so phenomenal. Oh, my God. And I need her. I can't believe it. You can't believe she found a man. <laughs> oh, boy. You were getting on my nerves with that one. I am so excited about the folks who I brought with me today. So, of course, I have this person here. Me. Margot. The fabulous other half. We also have our niece, Sydney. And then we have Tanya, who was a really close friend of ours. So my father just had um, a minor um, procedure with his heart on Monday. And I'm like, Dad, are you going to be able to come? And he's like, I won't miss it for the world. Dad, I didn't get to meet you, but I want to give you a hug. I do. The only person who's not here today is my mother. She died about two years ago. Her name was Lily. and. This here is her bouquet that she carried when she got married. So she's here in spirit. Oh, gosh. I'm not supposed to cry. I'm supposed to be happy. You are. These are happy tears. Yes. Tell me. Tell me about this man and the wedding and everything. His name is Corwin Austin. Sounds so formal, Corwin he Austin. Is. He, is, <laughs> he is a manly man. That's what he is. Yeah, I like yes. that. Yes. We met through a mutual friend a couple of years ago. This guy is amazing. He's so different than anyone I've ever dated, yet he he completes me, so I'm all hyper and extra, and he's calm, and sometimes he looks at me like, are you okay? Yeah, his family, they're all really kind of yeah, level. And then you have this fool who's like, ah! <laughs> The dress has to be as hyper as I. Like what, ball gowns or fitted or sexy? Whatever you <laughs> tell me to try on, I will. I'm open. She shouldn't be that open. How's our budget? Oh, my budget is anywhere from $100 to $10,000. Oh, that's perfect. Yes. <laughs> perfect. <laughs> Calm down. Close oh, your ears, my Dad. knees were giving away. So, are you ready to get started? I'm ready to get started. Okay, let's go back. Okay, let's give Margo her meds first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You better not be mean to me. Oh, gosh. Try to keep Margo in check. She's really You're getting on my nerves. I'm going to try. It's not going to be easy. Okay, well, I'm really anxious. Why? And it's because I've been hiding a secret from them. I want to surprise them. So I have something that I want to share with you. Oh, my God. Yes. <laughs> I can't. I don't. I, I, I'm, I can't. Right in that seat okay. over there. What in the world? Hold on a second. Wait a minute. Is they I don't know, know or I don't. You, what? No one knows. Gonna... I'm four months pregnant. Oh, my God. Yes. Congratulations. Oh, my God. Congratulations! <laughs> oh my, I can't yeah. even take and it. And so, when the wedding happens, I'm going to be seven and a half months pregnant. Oh, and yeah. so, we really have a situation that we have to dress. Oh, oh my God! Wait, but can we back up for one second? Yes. Nobody knows. No one knows. Your twin sister doesn't no. know that whole group out there. No one know. knows. Oh my God! I'm so <laughs> excited to be a part of this. You have no idea. I know, and the reason I haven't told them, I went to my doctor. They said you have to try for at least a year before you do anything aggressive like IVF. And the first time, the very first try. This is a blessing I'm beyond. I'm so excited. Be I'm so <laughs> happy for you. You be nice. If you don't have nothing nice to say, then don't say it at all, okay? Oh, thanks, Sydney, for giving me advice. Boom. <laughs> Spoken out of the mouths of babes. When are you going to tell them? Like, at what point? Today. Do you know? I mean, like, Today. have you decided when? Like, No, I figured you'd help me with that. Ah, okay. What do you think? I think it looks like the top of a cake. I don't like it. I don't like that. Why? You look fat. Why are you sticking out all in the gut area? Do I look pregnant? You know, that ain't so. She ain't pregnant.
Yes, I am. <gasps> oh, you messed up. What? Oh, God. Oh, you. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Are you serious? What do you think? Oh, my Look. God. It is a shock. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm shocked. You're going to be a granddad. And it's a boy. Are you oh. serious? Oh, oh. I'm about to cry. Oh, Lord. Are you serious? I just had a um, little heart problem, and I had a stent put in. And I'm glad I did have it now, because I got to hang around. Oh. She's pregnant. She's knocked up dead. I know. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh, no. <laughs> Let me sit down. I was telling a friend, I oh, know my twins aren't going to have any kids. Oh my God. I'm shocked. You get out. Oh, huh? You're serious? Yes. This is not a joke. No, I'm not joking. She's my twin sister, and I've always had her to myself, and I think I'm going to have to share her with the baby now. Wait, but understand, it's not this big now. Now? We put a fake belly in there. Oh, There's yeah. more months. You're my twin. How come you didn't tell me? You tell me everything. She tells me everything. Why did she not tell me about because that? Because of how you're acting right now, Margo. You should have told me before we went shopping for the dress that there was a situation brewing. Well, you kept saying I was getting fat. What if it comes early at the wedding? What the baby? Oh, God. Margo. You're going to look like a hot, ratchet mess. Margo, be quiet. I'm so excited about the baby, but not about you walking down the aisle eight months pregnant. Ooh. Look, girl, she's she gonna have ankles, cankles. She's gonna have to wear, she gonna have to wear flip flops. Oh my God. Look, why do you care about my feet? You won't see my feet. Oh, you're gonna be wobbling, wobbling. You know that dance? No, wobbling. Girl, she didn't wobble. You would think that she would be very sympathetic and very kind to me. Instead, she went the opposite direction and she went in for the kill. Margo, Margo, give her a break. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Give her Did a you break. Did you hear him? Designer. Pay no attention to this woman <laughs> sitting you. on the sofa. Thank you, Randy. Yes. Thank you. Okay, now go ahead, everyone else. Randy sitting on Margo is the best thing that he can do. He actually needs to sit on her and stay there. I'm so happy to finally see her smiling. We just had a little bump to get over. <laughs> What are your initial impressions? Um, I like this. Okay, from that's good. Let's look at it from the side view. <laughs> okay, let me tell you a couple of things. First of all, I know, yeah. This is between this and this, but <laughs> I'm gonna hide some of this. I'm gonna hide some of this. Okay. I look oh my like God. a big old basketball. Listen to me. A hot air balloon. While Margot is being mean, I know that what she is saying to me, it's actually how I'm feeling. I don't want to look like a hot mess, and I do. I saw her face already. I saw the little smirk on your face already, Margot. Marlo, I don't want to see any more tears. Marlo, I'm so sorry I was mean to you. I just, I just want you to look so beautiful. I didn't think you would cry. You were mean, Margo. But you know what? People would talk about you like a dog behind your back. I know. At I would least talk I about me like a dog, too. As you should. OK, we're good. We made up. We're sisters again. <laughs> That's a pretty okay. dress. OK, I'll take it. So how are you feeling right now? I feel like a hot mess. OK, at least you said it. She said it. I didn't say a word. I don't feel like a beautiful, blushing bride. I feel like that I'm going to be a spectacle. I told you. Margot's comments are somewhat irrelevant. I'm really going with how I feel. This is my big day, and so I want to walk down the aisle and feel as fabulous as every bride should feel on their big day. I look like a, a school bus from the side. Marlo, you are beautiful in whatever you put on. Oh, I just try to clean it up I, now. I, no, seriously, no, I'm being honest, Marlo. Only, you know me and you have that twin thing, you know, I can read your mind, and just like you can read mine. If you're feeling how I'm saying, don't do it. If this is what I could look like right. on that day, right. I'm gonna look a hot mess. You have to feel beautiful on your wedding day. And I honestly don't feel that you're gonna feel beautiful at eight months pregnant because you're not feeling beautiful now. Okay, but I have concluded 
I think that I'll wait. I'm going to push this wedding back so that I can get my body back in shape and feel as fabulous as I think I am. And so we're gonna do this all over again. Oh gosh. So why don't we focus on the baby now? Yes. And then we'll focus on the wedding later. That's right. Marlo, you will not regret that decision. I saved you, but you made me feel like I looked like a 10. You did. Okay. So I'm not saying yes to the dress, but we are saying yes to the yes baby. To the baby. Yeah. I'm gonna be jealous that you have a baby now because the baby's gonna take all your attention away from me. You have a husband. I know, but it's different. Okay, but Margo, you'll still be my best friend. The baby will be our best friend. Yes, he'll be our best friend. Group hug. <laughs> <Yeah>. oh. <laughs>